What's up, y'all? This is Team FTS. This is Aaron. I'm the intro guy, so I'm giving you an intro. Jet's on camera. There you go. <laughs> he doesn't Aaron. like doing the intro. Aaron, peace. Anyway, this is my um, Insector deck. Uh, Nick had an Insector deck, kind of gave up on it for Flame Sorens. But so I picked it up and was like, hey, I like this deck and I'm going to make it different. And um, I did, and it's been trolling. So here you go. Uh, the one For the ones that search and shit, the ones you want to equip stuff to is one Dragonfly, it's limited, and three Centipede. It searches out the equip cards and or this in, in case you open up with this or something like that. Uh, the cards that equip them are equipped and detach themselves would be these make rank, make rank fives. Hornet blows shit up. This makes it attack directly, but really this is just a 17 beater that unequips itself for these. Kelsey just hit his toe. Kelsey just hit his toe against the door. <laughs> Uh, and I run two game mats because it's way too OP not to run. People are like, oh, it's maybe a one up if you run it. Fuck that. I run it and, <laughs> and it whoops ass. Like, I have a dragonfly at like 44 because it's got this and like two equip spell cards. It's like, what the fuck? This is really OP. And whenever it's destroyed, you special summon an insector from your grave. So, literally, if you have a dragonfly and a centipede, you can have this centipede equip. This is equipped with dragonfly. This. How do you envision this better? Hold on, I got y'all. Boom, boom. Let's horn it. All right. Can... <laughs> All right. Oh my god. So it's like this. You hit this to hit this. Then the Giga Man is special summon something from the grave, so you can get another centipede, and then search some more shit. It's like combos are endless with this deck. And See, I didn't know that he he was the one that special, special summons. Summon. Yeah. Yeah, he's fucking great. Okay. Yeah. Anyway. So combos are endless with that, with those. So that's why I run two of them. Uh, for the tour guide part, it's two tour guides, Sangin and a night night assailant. Just yeah, kind of pisses people off. It's standard waste surveyors on that. Right? Exactly. Good. Uh, two mixed tomatoes. I like it. Yeah. What's the other secret? What? I don't, bitch, you just gave me the one you had. Oh. <laughs> what is this rare? That's a dual league or something like that. It's got like orange letters. I thought it, yeah, I thought it was a. Whatever. Yeah, dual sleep. Anyway, yeah, two Mr. Tomatoes basically they attack into it. So if they have two monsters, I let them attack into both of them. And the, the last, when they don't have an attack, I summon Dragonfly or something like that. Uh, Gore's track, track. Oh, Keeps the monster on field. I like track a lot. It helps me take their monsters and overlay really easily. And it stays on the field usually because I don't waste a lot of my hand because I just recycle stuff from the grave. So I like track a lot. It's like the MVP. If it was at three, I'd run it at three. So here's a question for What's you up? Why don't you like Car Trooper in this deck? Uh, because I don't need it, and I don't like the fact that Car Trooper mills my spell cards. I don't like milling. Like, unless I'm playing with a Light Sword deck, I don't like milling. Because it, I, I have terrible luck with it. Yes. I hate the shit, honestly. So, I don't <laughs> like Car Trooper because first, even if I do, it's like, oh, you get a draw, but I take 3,000 life points. So why the fuck would I want somebody to rape my face like that, okay? I'm just, I don't know. And then the boss monsters. Dad. Dad, dad. Daddy. And then I, I choose to run Dark Creator because I, I always have a lot of darks in Grave. This is amazing. I, it's never a dead card. Because even if you're getting your ass whooped, you'll still have five engraved. You can just special out, and then that gets back your Dragonfly. Then you combo out completely and win. I, I really like this card, especially with that Dragonfly and like the searches and like yeah, the setup. Yeah, exactly. Everything. It's See, he, I, I played him, and he was like, what the fuck? Yeah, I didn't know they ran that. They don't. I do. All right. It works. It's a really good card, guys. All right. Two spells. Two MST. <laughs> Boring. <laughs> I know. Uh, two, two little swords. Two ulti. Yeah, I like the sword. Ulti's that count. Sword uh, gets an insector monster yeah. from your grave and puts it to your hand whenever it sends to the graveyard. So you can have it equipped it to two level threes, overlay to the level threes, and then get something to your hand with, just because it was sent to the graveyard. So that's why I like sword a lot. It's, it gets you back your dragonfly. Um, this card makes shit really buff, which is why I run it. I just like how buff. Like, also, he becomes a, he becomes a Fitzgerald. I like yeah, there you true. go. If it attacks, you can't. Uh, <laughs> I, I bet you all. Every, I bet you everyone knows uh, my my admiration for Fitzgerald. It's his name. He's okay. Yeah. All right. Good. This gets back Dragonfly once it's gone. That's the reason and why. That shit's hollow, isn't it? Yep, hollow dark. I haven't Rotary. actually seen a hollow dark. Well, I had it in Black Wings before. Like this got reprinted, so it's yeah. cool. It's a big deal. Then I got my common foolish barrel, sand hornet. Why is that super? Like, because super thirty dollars. <laughs> <laughs> common allure, heavy because. I don't run traps like Black that. Black Rider. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Go. Must Reborn. Book. You know, staples for Aaron. I think Book is a staple. I don't care. If y'all want to argue with me, y'all can. Yeah, I like Book too. Double I'm Warning. I mean, that. it stops X Seeds, Synchros, Effects. I mean, it stops everything. Book is a really good card. It stops attacks. Save shit. All right. I like, warnings. Com I like comboing with Aaron, the White Sworn Aaron. 
<laughs> well, but the monsters still flip though, so it's like it just depends on what you book. Uh, trap stun. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. I run trap stuns because I don't want to get bottomless or for them to warn my shit or to torrential my shit. Okay, that's why I run trap stun. That's I, the Solemn Brigade and bottomless and shit that pisses me off like torrential. This stops. So like I'm gonna combo out. I try to. I play Dragonfly, they're like, okay, I hit something. Then I'm like, okay, Centipede, they want to bottomless my Centipede, now I have a duck-ass Dragonfly stuck on the field. I don't want that. That's why I run Trap Stun, it helps, it, I do this right before I combo out, and it works every time. Yeah, I like, I like Trap Stun I'm a too. big fan of Trap Stun. It. Double Call, if you can start your turn with an Insector on the field already, then you are going to combo hard as fuck. Which is why I run Call, because it's amazing. So you can like Call, and if they don't want to waste their warning on it because they're scared of what you're going to summon, then you can Trap Stun right after that, your monster already on the field, you're straight. It's like, whoa, I can't believe that just happened to me, why did I let that happen? It's just more stuff. And then Double Threatening Roar. Threatening Roar keeps your shit alive, and stops OTKs. A lot of like people like using OTK decks, specifically Jet with his Lice Horns, Atlanteans, like, or the Mermails like to OTK, uh, Windups have an OTK, fuck. Everything has an OTK. This stops against OTK and big destruction for one turn. So that's why I like this. That's why I run it at two. And it's one of those traps that gets off the field really easily. So Also Boris. have the MST that you can just activate. Exactly. Right away, yeah. It's a chainable trap and I like it a lot. Two the extra decks. What time are we at? Well, I have Six minutes. Alright, what do you have? What's wrong? Why don't you run Doom Dozer? What? It's not as good as Dark Creator. Oh, he asked, why, he asked why don't, why don't I run Doom Dozer? What's Doom Dozer's effect anyways? Oh, we'll talk about this later. Anyways. Anyway, it's, it's a 2800 B stick, but basically it's just I didn't have room and I chose Dad over it because I like Dad and I can I'd use, rather use Dad than Doom Dozer too then. Dad has an acronym. I mean, alright, anyway. I don't have room, dog. Level 3's. You should, you should try also taking this out for the one that I can attack twice. What's his name? Mellow, Mellow Melody. That's what? her name. I don't really go for that. This is this is literally just to get rid of the problem childs. Like, BLS is dropped on me. This gets rid of that. Temtebo gets rid of XCs. Zen mains is Zen mains. Leviathan, it detaches, um, like, right after some it detaches so you can Monster Reborn your Dragonfly back. Levier gets back your shit you banish with that. There you go. Or in case they bottom list the fuck out of your centipede. Uh, Pearl, I never really owe XC for fours, so this is my only... Rank four, literally, it's just in case I have track. Um, I discard the level four thingy that I can't remember the name of. Mystic Tomato. No. Well, what? yeah, Mystic Tomato. I'm talking about the Insector. Oh, this Hopper. Hopper. There you go. There you go. Him, or if I have Hopper on the field and some other shit, you know, it's a rare occasion. That's why I have this. I have a lot of five, so I go into five because I run so many ladybugs. Dupe, dupe. All right, this one of these is gonna be. Another number 12 because this is my favorite rank 5 because it's OP as fuck. It just yeah, sticks around. It. It's kind of like an infinite threatening roar. It's like, I can't die by effects or battle. I just detach, suck my dick. That's basically what he says. So I like him a lot. I want to run two. Aegis is really good. Suck a dick. This takes a monster, which is why I like it. And then this card inflicts a lot of damage. A lot of damage. I don't know what that thing does. It um makes one of your, one, makes your, makes you, okay, makes your opponent lose... Um, life points equal to the attack of a, of a monster, and then this card gains attack equal to, I think, equal or half of that monster inflicted. This card gains attack equal to the damage inflicted. So basically, it gets really fucking buff, and you already take. So you have BLS, then you take 3,000, then this card gains 3,000, I beat your face in. Boom! This card's is good and cheap, he guys. Kept, he kept, like, he was pissing me off with that number 12. Just huh? like, oh, yeah, the number 12. Yeah, this guy, this guy was making me mad. <laughs> I want another one. He's JD like, Proof. Yeah, this um card is really undervalued, and I really like it. So pick them up while they're cheap, because they're really undervalued. Um, oh, I like them. I want Strike Bouncer, and I want the other the six R Insector thing. That's What's worth a Strike a lot. Bouncer? I'm just joking. <laughs> anyway, but this is just what? an example of a rank six I use, basically only for Trag, in case they have a Trag. I mean, literally, I discard a Gigamanus to take their level six target. Um, Gigamanus with Trag's effect overlay for six. That's basically. Yeah. It's like, what? Uh, this covers up your Exastag and Exabutyl, which I don't have. I need Exabutyl. Um, yeah. Or your useless, whatever, it's 200 pierces OP card. And then... Hey, Heliopolis. That's literally for Trag. <laughs> that's it. <laughs> yeah, like, if Trag's on the field, I'm able to pull that off. Other than that, it's like, I'm not. So, yeah. Cool. That, that was is. Aaron's Insector deck. With commentary. I like it. All right, like, comment, subscribe, check out other videos. We just uploaded like five other videos, <laughs> so check them out. And uh, 
Tell your friends. Go like it. Comment. Subscribe. Check out my clean ass mat. Look at this mat. We just yeah, watched it's it. It's sparkly. It's like it's like goat. it's holographic. That's Vegito foil. Vegito is Vegito. <laughs> He's going right now. All right, go check out our other stuff. Like, comment, subscribe. Let us know what y'all think. He's blown. I don't know what's wrong with him. <laughs> Eating Pringles. All right. All right. Um, yeah, we're done. All right.